Welcome to the first episode. Welcome to the first episode of Late Night with Tonzi. And here's your host, our man, Tonzi. Good evening, guys. Good evening to all listeners of PinoyPodcast.com. Tonzi here, and I'm with Coach G and DJ Shandella. How are you guys? We're good. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Shame. We're all good. All right. All right. So, uh... We're all good. I'm all fired up. <laughs> You're all fired up for tonight. I'm, we're launching your show tonight. Uh-huh. This is your first episode. Uh-huh. And are you ready to set the... Uh, set this on fire? Ready na. Nag-advance na nga yung oras eh. <laughs> Okay, uh, Tansi, what what time are you gonna be on air and on what days? Uh, normal, uh, normally, right? Uh, Saturday, 10 p.m. It's gonna be 10 p.m. PH time and 10 a.m. New York time. Every Saturday, oh. that's gonna be um, <clears throat> that's a normal hour. That's a normal time of, of, of our program with uh with me late night show with Tansi. That's it. And this is your show, right? Yep, pretty much. Yeah, man. yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> so. And this has been. Um, mm-hmm. I mean, you've been preparing for this for how long? Uh, for how long? Actually, nasabi mo na sa akin to a few weeks ago, eh. Pero uh, I've been preparing for this for for mm-hmm. for a week. Medyo medyo naging busy lang. Supposedly, dapat nag-air na to last week pa, eh, kaso. Uh, naging busy, personal stuff and yeah, so finally, finally, natuloy din <laughs> alright Tanzi I'm gonna okay. go I'm, I'm, I'm gonna go back to the operating uh, center uh-huh. I mean to the, uh, to the DJ panel and yeah, this is your show, okay take it away, alright alright, hi guys, hi Sean G, you're here, right? yeah, okay. what are we going to talk okay, about okay, tonight? Okay. Uh, all right. So without any further ado, we'll, we'll, the topic for tonight, uh, it's called the uh, top ten scandal that buzz our nation in this recent years. So uh, I'm gonna tally different topics from ah uh, different uh, different controversy and scandal from ten to one, and we're just gonna talk about it. All right. Uh, uh, Tingnan natin mamaya if uh, if if the listeners or or whoever man uh kung sino man kung kung mag-aagree kung mag-aagree sila sa tali natin. All right? If it's an alleged then then let's let's exchange thoughts about it. If it if you think it's real or it's fake then then that's it. All right? Okay. 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 So so let's start. Okay. <laughs> Ready na ba? Ready na ba? Yeah. All right, all right, all right, all right. Number number ten. Let's start at number ten, okay? Uh, okay. Guys, you know, naman Miss Miss Sharon Conetta, right? Everybody knows her. Especially Sharon Conetta. Kahit, kahit Kaneta? Sa, oh, oh, naman kahit nasa abroad, right? Okay. Yeah, Miss Sharon. Kaneta. All right. Last 2011, she had um a billboard in Elsa. Are Are you aware about this, Shen? No. What specific no, okay, okay. billboard? Right, right. Um, she had a billboard in EDSA about uh, an ad about uh, slimming product at that, right? As far as I know, yeah. And um, alam naman natin that, that uh, Sharon is medyo, ano, mataba. <laughs> okay. <laughs> diba? And then, uh, she has a billboard. Uh, this uh, particular uh, um ad company, uh, they put up a billboard in EDSA na al- parang al- for me, uh, for me, it was definitely altered na from 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 her specific from her itsura then parang pinotoshop siya, ginawa siyang ginawa siyang mapayat I think it is for for ano, a billboard for Mary Friends yeah, 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 for for Mary Friends ah, pwede pala na mention uh-huh. ng broad 
Right. Yeah. So uh-huh. guys, yung, yung, that's our number 10. Medyo medyo ano pa tayo? Medyo um medyo watch comics. Medyo Why why why, 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 is this, hmm? why is this Why is this uh, is, billboard of Sharon Cunetas a controversy? Ah uh, because ah uh, uh, this con ah uh, alam mo yung Hayden ko, right? The controversy hmm. of celebrity Hayden ko. Um Hayden ko tweeted something like there's a billboard at the net so developed by advertiser who think consumers are stupid. Mm-hmm. And assuming that um assuming si ano eh, si Sharon eh, na na oh ako yan. So what Sharon ah, okay. did was what Sharon did was um um, nag ano siya na 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 affected siya nagsalita siya na kento na na bakit ka bakit ka nagsasalita ng gano ay bakit ka nagti-tweet ng gano ang itsura ko naman ganto but Sharon Sharon insisted that that the the billboard is ano is not altered not photoshop it was real na na yung itsura niya in the billboard is ganun siya kapayat she 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 never denied na 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 it was na photoshop or whatever talagang insist niya mm-hmm. talagang stand siya na that ad is is real so everyone is everyone this? everyone the when was, this? was like 2011 or 2011 two years ago actually personally hindi ko siya nakita eh. sa website ko lang sa mga ano ko lang uh-huh. siya nakita sa actually okay. sa isang forum nakita ko siya eh. so kaya siya naging controversy syempre alam mo na may mga netizens right pag, pag may mga ganun excuse pag may mga ganun na parang pineke na sobrang sobrang affected yung mga yan eh. sobrang sabi nila oh peke yan peke yan durog na yung pagkatao <laughs> mataba well, actually Sharon had a TV Sharon had a TV show we've always known Sharon as ano eh as you know on the healthy side oh nga yun um, nga eh. The thing here is, kaya siya talaga kinukuha ng mga ad- advertisers is because she sells. Parang lahat ata nang i-endorse ni Sharon, mabibenta. Guys, mm. I got a call from uh, Kiko Pangilinan. Uh-huh. He objected to the use of the word mataba. <laughs> Girl, guys, oh, what the hell? <laughs> Guys, apparently that time na lumabas yung tweet ni Hayden ko. That time meron siyang show, ongoing show sa isang TV pro, uh, TV station. Sino ang may ongoing show? Si Sharon, si Sharon. And sa so, ah, okay. ongoing show niya that that time, medyo malaki siya, medyo mataba siya. Kaya when the when the billboard was was put up, yun, dun na nag-start. Baka naman kasi, eh, baka naman kasi kaya nag-tweet ng ganun si Hayden is because hindi na ko ni Belo si Sharon Coneta at sa kompetensya pumunta. Well, never know. <laughs> Siguro. Diba? Pwede rin. Pwede rin. Pwede rin. Pwede rin. If right, I'm so not mistaken our... kasi, if I'm not mistaken, ang, ang talent fee ni Sharon Coneta for every commercial, pinakamababa na ang 20 million pesos. Talaga. So, pero alam mo yung 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 ad na to ha eventually tinanggal din. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> yeah, tinanggal din nila. Hindi <laughs> na siguro uh-huh. kinaya. <laughs> oh, so that was your n- number 10. What is your number 9? Okay. Number 9, ito medyo not so recent pero ito mating dito eh. The the another another net yes, na hindi siya ano, hindi siya hindi siya masyadong uh-uh. Hindi siya masyadong vulgar, okay. pero super controversy, super controversy siya. Alright? That's okay. the... Okay. That's What's the... number nine? Number nine, alright? Number nine is Chris Aquino. Uh-huh. The STD scandal. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah, I've heard that. Yeah. Right, yeah, the right, FTD right. ca- scandal with is this with Joey Marquez, right? Yep, 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 yep. Joey Marquez okay. had infected her with sexually transmitted disease. Hindi ko alam mo kailan 'to. 
Pero, pinag-usapan nyo ko din ng matindi. Do you remember this? Yeah, I remember that. What's your, what's your, what's your stand on that? I mean, oh, being, my being a Chris Aquino. Uh-huh. Kasi, alam mo, um, kung, di ba, bakit ka ba nagkakaroon ng STD? Mm. It's because you're not practicing safe, safe sex, right? Mm-hmm. So, Chris Aquino ka, di ba? May pinag-aralang hey, are we, are we, I mean, anak ng presidente. Sanzi, is it, right? Sanzi, is it, ano, ang issue ba dito is, kaya ka nagkaka-STD is because you don't practice safe sex or you're not being faithful? Uh, Chris Aquino, may, meron siyang, that time, ang boyfriend niya is, boyfriend, ang partner niya is Joey Marquez, right? Mm-hmm. Noong Joey Marquez, kung ikaw ang part ng Joey Marquez, are you, are, even if, even if you, you love him so much, are you, are you gonna, are you gonna risk knowing that na, eto, babaero to, ganyan, eto, siguro, mm-hmm. siguro aware din sila na pinag-usapan lang, may sakit siya. Kasi, ano ito eh, uh, pers- celebrity to eh, imposibleng walang annual check to. Siyempre, pag, pag may mga, <clears throat> Especially Joey Marquez is a uh, diba? politician, so may medical yan. So, paano sila nag ano? Paano, as a Chris Aquino, ikaw na lang as babae, if you have a boyfriend like Joey Marquez, are you, are you gonna, are you gonna risk? Or are you gonna, are you gonna be like, um, uh, uh, if you're gonna mo. make, let's, let's, uh, let's do, let's do this. Yeah, okay. It's uh, like this, eh. sabi mo, if I'm the girl, I have a boyfriend like Joey Marquez is known to be a womanizer and if we're gonna do it you know I mean I cannot like impose to him that you were, you were the rubber thing because magkakaroon din ng kulay ito sabihin niya sa akin what you don't trust me you think I have other sex sex partners aside from you diba so the thing here is when you're in a relationship it's about you know practicing I know safe sex. It, the thing is, you have to be faithful to your partner. Kailangan wala ka ng ibang ka, kalukadidang sa, sa, sa side side, di ba? To avoid STD. Pero the problem and is, Joey for... Marcus. Pero mm-hmm. what if, what if Joey Marcus has already, ano na, has already STD before, before meeting Chris? <laughs> What is I don't know because they, 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 oh, they've been diba? together about 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 three years at the time when the when the STD issue came out. So I guess kung it it didn't happen at the start of the relationship. It was on the latter part. So at the, the time, siguro uh, Joey Marquez is not really being faithful to Chris Aquino, and this this whole thing became so controversial because Chris Aquino is Chris Aquino. Yep. You know, from from an affluent family, um, being the daughter of Ninoy Aquino, this is really a big issue. And for 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 a while, I I admire her na uh, lumabas siya out in the open to to tell to tell what happened. Because it's not really ano eh. Maraming pwedeng maapekto hantun sa ginawa niya, the family, her career, mga endorsements niya. She could almost lose everything nung ginawa niya yung ginawa niya. And still, ginawa niya kasi she want, she, she's standing up as a woman na hindi dapat yung ganun yung trata sa akin. That's why it's all controversial. Yeah, pero alam mo, uh, the, the, this STD thing came from Chris Aquino herself, mm. di ba? Not, not from Joey Marcus. Yeah. Kasi Joey Marcus is, ano eh, he's, uh, tinatakot niya si Chris eh. Like, uh, nabasa ko eh. So source, <laughs> like uh, uh, he he he's threatening uh Chris Aquino that na na if Mike pag kiwale ka sa akin, ilalab uh i- ikakalat ko na you have ST. I believe um hindi hindi lumabas si si Chris Aquino sa press because of the STD thing. I believe lumabas siya sa press because sinasaktan na siya ni Joey Marquez. I guess that was the uh, the thing. Yeah, that's the issue. 
So, number nine pa so lang yun. <laughs> and what's number eight? <laughs> okay, number eight. Alright. Ito, hindi siya masyadong, ano, hindi siya masyadong uh, napag-usapan. But, let's let's see this. Number eight. The, the, the Ethel Buba and Alex Crisana scandal. What do you think of this? Have you, have you watched this? Yeah, I've seen that. Okay, the thing here is, maraming celebrity na may hilig sa mga, ano, no, sa mga basketball player. <laughs> okay. Right? Right? Tapos yung, uh-huh. ano, yung, yung The Ethel Buba and Alex Quisano scandal. Ang pinaka-scandal dito, ang, ang nagkalat daw, uh, apparently, ang nagkalat, reportedly, is the strange wife of, of Alex Quisano, which is, I don't know yung name eh, siya daw yung nag ng video. Mm-hmm. So, 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 uh, syempre, kung ikaw ang celebrity, uh, Ethel Buba, hindi niya naman din eh. <laughs> it was, it was real. Well, uh, there's no sense in denying it. Video, right? Yeah, mm-hmm. kasi halata He's naman. Eh. Pero, the, 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 pero okay. ang, 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 ang issue niya, paano naikalat nung, nung, nung dating wife ni, ni ng boyfriend niya ng partner niya mm-hmm. so ayun, uh, do you know up until now if they're still together I think this was 2000 no they're not hindi na uh, they're not together anymore um kung tama ang pagkakarinig ko Alex Cresano now is a reform man I guess he's a pastor now if I'm not mistaken okay But he's still playing, uh-huh. no? I, I I can see him playing pa sa, sa PBA, sa basketball. And uh-huh. he's, a pa- he's a pastor now as well. Uh-huh. Right. Okay, okay. That's number eight. Hindi masyadong, ano eh, hindi masyadong napag-usapan, pero yung napanood. Time check. What's number seven? Time check. Alright, time check muna tayo. So, 9.57 p.m. Manila time. Okay. Uh, before the number 8, right? Uh, 9.57 a.m. your time. Is G still there? Yeah, yeah. it's in the back. <laughs> right, it's in the job, back. Guys. All right, thank you. All right, all right. Let's, let's, let's move forward. Number 7. Okay, what's number 7? Ito, ito, recent lang ito. Recent. So, sobrang nito lang, I think, last year. The, the Claudine Barreto versus Montel for boxing match. <laughs> The Claudine Barreto and ah the Claudine and Company <laughs> versus is that with Montel. the Tulfo with yeah. one Tulfo? <laughs> yep, the boxing match in Aya Three. Okay. All right, that's number seven. Because, because Grey mo ah, di ba magkasawa kayo? Hmm. Tapos itong si Mon Tulfo, di ba? Siya yung sa mga Tulfo brothers. Alam ko siya na yung pinakamatanda eh, right? Yeah. Talaga, yeah. nakita ko ito eh. Yung itsura niya talaga, matanda na. Hindi siya katulad ng mga, mga kapatid niya medyo, ano pa eh, medyo macho-macho pa eh. Ito, ito nakita ko ito matanda talaga eh. Mataba na matanda. So, so, uh, so, alam naman natin pinagtulungan, di ba? Nat- natatawa ka ba? <laughs> Hindi. <laughs> pinipigil ako. Pinipigilan ko mag-sneeze. <laughs> Okay. Mm, all right, all right. So, uh, teka, teka. Sino sino pinagtulungan nino? Sino pinagtulungan nino? The the clothing and company, clothing and and his uh, her her husband or ex-husband na ata naghiwalay na, right? Sino, pinagtulungan Charlie. ng mag-asawa si Tulfo. Yep. At saka mayroon pang isang guy. Mayroon pang isang guy. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, Actually, I, I'm really not aware of this uh, ano of this issue Since hindi ko talaga siya napanood at hindi ko oo at hindi ko siya talaga pinagtuunan ng attention kasi ano eh parang away bata mm. pero sobrang nag ano siya nag naging issue siya kasi these are these are celebrities fighting over oh alam mo na- kasi yung mga yung mga tulfo na yan matatapang lang yan pag nasa TV oo oh, oh. Hindi, pero kung hinamon mo yan kung hinamon mo yan ng fair and square hindi naman sumisipot yan hinamon nga ang dami na naghamon ng suntukan dyan hindi naman sumipot yan matapang lang yan pag may hawak na mikropono ayan na. kasi ano sila eh uh, 
di ba, mga anchor sila, mga uh, mga broadcaster. So, mm-hmm. syempre, mas matapang sila pag pag nasa nasa radio sila or TV. So, that's that's natural. Pero etong mag-asawa, bakit ang tapang? <laughs> Nagigipagsuntukan. <laughs> di ba? Ano yun? Invasion of privacy. Hindi, Kasi, gano'n ano, naman ang na natural, eh. gano'n naman ang natural reaction mo, Tonzi, eh. Kung nalang yung asawa mo. Yung babae, yung asawa mo, saktan ng ano, di ba? Siyempre, pagtatanggol mo yun. Gano'n na nangyayari no, doon, eh. The problem eh, is, ang nanguna daw, is the, is the, is the, ano, the mag-asawa. Kaya Biglado nga. Biglado nila Oh, kasi uh, kung sinagang bastos na, di ba? <laughs> Kahit ako, sasapakin ko yun eh. Mapatol ako sa lalaki. <laughs> Kawawa lalaki sa'yo. <laughs> okay, what's number? Okay, ano number na tayo? Number six? Uh, number six. Uh, number six, yeah. After this number six, uh, we'll gonna play some music. <laughs> Third time muna tayo. I believe, right? Okay. Okay. Alright, let, let's move on to number six. Okay. Uh, uh ito, recent lang rin. Ewan ko kung, kung nabalita mo to. The Rian Ramos and Mo Twister scandal. Uh, not actually scandal, uh, controversy lang. First off, the, the, there are two parts. The, the first uh, uh, controversy here is, ano, is, uh, mayroon silang video. They're, they're being intimate sa, in front of the camera kissing and and humping pero that's dry dry thing lang wala silang ginagawang iba they're just being celebrity doing something in front of the camera that's why it became uh that's why it became somehow scandal ba or whatever and then the part to here is the alleged uh alleged abortion of Rian Ramos uh-huh. what do you think what do you think is it is it real or fake Um, I, mean, I don't up, know. Heard, knowing, heard of yeah, I heard the I heard the issue. But knowing mm. Mo, mm. you know what 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 what's with Mo? Mo is really madaldal. He's really tactless. But most of the time, he's telling the truth. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, nga. no. Oh, yeah. So, no. ang ano lang dito is talagang um, it's it's not. Uh, natural of a man to to act like that, de ba? Na porque the, the relationship turns sour, na ibubuko mo ko ano nangyari sa inyo. This kiss and tell, it's it's really like that. But most of the time, he's telling the truth. Yep, yep. So so you think it's real that Rian Ramos had abortion in in? Oh Singapore? well, um. Hindi ko na alam kasi hindi ko naman na malaya na si Rian Ramos ay nawala. As far as uh-huh. I know, she's always been visible. So, uh-huh. siguro ito yung pagkakataon lang na hindi matanggap ni Mo Twister na everything is over. Uh-huh. You know? And well, ganun naman yung mga artista, di ba? If, if they're, uh, if napagbintangan silang buntis, they, they usually go out, right? They usually lie low. Tapos, malalaman mo lang andyan na pala pero the thing is yung, yung sinabi mo nga uh, you think that Rian Ramos has never been been away right like she's mm-hmm. always active so okay. hindi, hindi natin alam eh. it's an alleged eh. we don't know if Mo Twister is, is saying uh, if yung sinasabi niya is to or uh, Rian Ramos is, had really uh, abortion we don't know but anyway it's, it's it, you know naging controversial siya uh, kasi again mo twister and weird ramos <laughs> pero uh, the kissing thing ito usually na, uh, may napanood lang dalo dalawang celebrity na na nag kiss in front of the camera pero that's their private uh, private thing na kumalat lang what do you think of this uh, you think you can call it scandal if Do you think fair yun? Kasi sa porket celebrity ka, tapos naghalikan na kayo sa... sa Paano ba lumabas yung video? Paano ba lumabas yung video? We don't know. But usually, sinasabi nila, na-hack daw yung <laughs> hard drive nila. Or, or alam mo yun. Pero, pero if, 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 uh, if you were in, your, in, in her foot, or, or ikaw ang nasa katayuan nila, 
Okay, hindi mo naman pwede masabi yung scandal yan. Pwede mo naman sabihin, or, oy, ang sweet nga namin, nagkakalikang kami in front of the camera. Di ba? Mm-hmm. It, it's, 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 it doesn't draw the line na ito matatawag mong scandal because we're just kissing. We're just using our tongue. We're just, we're just playing. Wala, wala nudity or whatever. Di ba? Yeah. Oh, I, 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 may ganun ako. Sabihin ko, oh, ano naman, sweet lang kami. <laughs> oh, but, Ang nangyari kasi dyan is lumaki nang lumaki because of the um, abortion issue. Yep. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Okay naman. Alright, so, uh-huh. so. But it seems na nakamove on na si Rian because he's with, uh-huh. she's with uh-huh. Casey now. Uh-huh. And mo, I don't mo. I don't know Ren. I don't know Ren with Rian Ramos. You know she's beautiful. Oh my, she's intelligent. Hello. She's so pretty really smart. Bro. Alam mo wala, wala siyang ano eh. Wala walang angulo si Rian eh. Wala kang angulo ng makikitang pangit siya. <laughs> Oo, hindi walang tapon eh, 'di ba? Walang tapon si Rian Ramos. Ang hindi ko lang maintindihan sa batang ito. <laughs> bakit ano? Bakit um What you call this? Um, parang lagi siyang nakokonek sa maling lalaki. <laughs> Bakit mo parang... maling kay mo? <laughs> oh, well, mo is, ano, uh, uh, um, I'm not saying mo. naman mali, pero, di ba, I mean, sa state ni Rian, sa itsura niya, at sa mentalidad niya, marami pa siyang ma-attract na lalaki. Ma- Ay, lalaki na masigit mm. kay Mo Twist. Ay. At higit pa kay Katie. So, I don't know what gives. I don't know what's eating them. So, siguro, that's love. You know, we cannot question that. Pag-ibig yan. Alright, okay, okay. So, ano, let's move on to number five. But before we move on to number five, uh, yes. we're gonna play some music. Break time on the tire, alright? Okay, yes. yes. We're gonna be right back. You're listening to Lightbox.com, and this is the premiere episode of Late Night with Tansi. Time check, it's 10.15, we will be right back. Thank you. 
And we're back. Hi guys. Again guys, you're, you're listening to PinoyPodcast.com. Program title is Late Night Show with Tansi. And I'm here with Chandela and G. Hello guys. Hi Tansi, we're back. Yeah, we're back, we're back. Oh, you know what? I think you have promoted your show very well. On that, <laughs> yeah, look at your audience, huh? We have Wednesday, we have Stu, JDC, and Thor. Hi, Lindsay. Hi, Drew. Hi, JDC and Thor. Come on, come on, Okay. And we are. So, so, what's up? I don't know. Number five. <laughs> what's your five point five? Oh, pala, guys. Uh, meron. Uh, we before before the the break before the song we ended at uh, number six. Uh supposedly we're gonna be uh. Uh, number five, pero meron tayong 5.5, alright? Okay guys, our, uh, sa mga newcomer, sa mga new listener who just tuned in, our, our topic for tonight is uh, top 10 scandal, so, local celebrity scandal that uh, rock our nation in these recent years, alright? So yeah, number five, and uh, before our number five, we have this 5.5. Alam ko, okay. uh, Yung iba sa inyo. <laughs> um, Alam mo, very, ano, ah, very pasok tong 5.5 na to. Talagang sa, nasi, oh, no? Oo. Oh, 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 kasi, yung, 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 yung ano mo rin, yung subject mo, medyo ano rin, eh. <laughs> okay. Go ahead. Medyo 5.5 lang, ah. Hindi interest ito, ah. Aha. Alright, 5.5. Uh, wala bang kumakain dyan? <laughs> okay. Okay, the 5.5 is, ito, yung nagsha-shower siya. Oh. Sa left. Ano siya? Okay, ano siya? Sikat. Okay, sikat. Tapos may, may, may kumalat siyang video na naliligo siya. Tapos, habang oh. naliligo siya, habang naliligo siya, nak- Tumatawa pa. Kasi, okay. <laughs> Naliligo na. Mm-hmm. Inukuha ng video. Masaya pa. <laughs> okay. Uh, baba. Ah, ito guys. Ah. Baka isipin nyo. Lalaki to. Medyo. Iba yun. Alright. Okay. Number five. Pangalanan na natin. It's the Mahal Scandal. <laughs> oh. Napanood ko yan. Nagkatabo siya dyan. Right? Tabo ba? Oo. Sino ba kung pukuha ng video? Sino pa naroon pala yun? Oo naman, napapad ka yan. Baka yung boyfriend niya. Di ba may maraming boyfriend niya si Ma? Kasi, you know, I used to live in Pampanga. And Jim Boy, who's supposedly the boyfriend of Mahal at that time, is actually a friend. Ah, talaga? Siguro, ano ka yeah. <laughs> Baka karibal ka ni Mahal, eh? No, act- actually, Jim Boy is gay. <laughs> Ayaw nga pala, no? Jim Gay pala, Jim Gay. <laughs> Oo. Kasi, at the time, at the time, um, Jim Boy, who's um, into showbiz, diba? Um, nakilala siya because of the uh, Jim Boy and Mahal tandem. But at the time, at the same time, Jim Boy is in a relationship with a guy who's twice his age. So, before before he met Mahal, ano yun talaga siya? Bading siya talaga. Game. At may karelasyon. Oo, may, may karelasyon siya. siya. Oo, na twice his age. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. And no, yung, how, how old was Jim Boy that time? What do you think? Uh, range lang? 20s? Yeah, siguro mga 24 at the time. Tumatambay yan si Jim Boy sa store ko eh. Oh, I managed uh, the family business in 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 San Fernando noon. Tumatambay yan sa store ko. So, doon, hmm. nagkakakwentuhan kami, ganyan. And I know he's into our relationship. Nagulat nga ako nung bigla na 
Oh, you're with Mahal. Ganyan. <laughs> diba? They kiss pa on TV. Ganyan. I love you, I love you. Ganyan, ganyan. <laughs> so, yun. And, okay. Eh, ano namang reaction niya yung sinabi mo? Ay, ano naman sabi niya? Ano sabi niya? That, that's showbiz. I just wanna enter and make make a name for myself. That's why I, I use Mahal. <laughs> Pero mas sumikat si Mahal, di ba? Yeah. Alam mo, ang daming controversial na issue dyan sa ano na yan eh. Ang daming controversial na issue dyan sa gym boy mahal na yan, but hindi ko siya pwedeng sabihin at sigurado madidemanda ako. <laughs> Ganun? Uh-uh. Don't mention name. Oo, madidemanda ako sigurado. Marami, lumalayang sitwasyon ni eh. Lumalayan, lumawig, lumawak, um, naging madugo, naging, you know, it, it's ano, it's, It's a dangerous topic to tackle, so we move on to number five. <laughs> <laughs> so, bagay, five point five lang naman siya, alright. Oh, yeah. uh-huh. Guys, number five, uh, five point five, right? It's the mahal scandal. Mm-hmm. Alright, let, let, let's move on to number five, because pang ano lang talaga yung five point five eh. uh-huh. na si it lang, right? Ito uh-huh. number five. Ano lang to two years ago. Okay. Uh, the guy. The guy is a, a good actor, good-looking guy, diba Shen? Okay. And the girl, the man, uh, she's she's really beautiful. Um, Mistisa, and magaling na actress din, okay din, magaling sumayaw. And um, alam, alam natin, right, that they had a relationship before, 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 mm-hmm. they, they, they were together. So, mm-hmm. <laughs> Etong guy na to is sobrang sikat. And we all know this guy. His name is Chandler Cruz. And the scandal okay. is the 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 the, the luck thing. <laughs> 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 the the penis luck scandal, man. Oh my goodness. <laughs> is it is that the no? Is that bluff or ano yan? A fact. Nga, y- y- yun ang, pr- ang tanong ko sa iyo. It's alleged kasi. What do you think? It's real or fake? <laughs> I think for me that's a no. It's a sham. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It might be fake, might be real. We don't know. Kasi, uh-huh. uh, John Lloyd Chris naman yun, siya yun na mag-dial. Uh, they both stated naman na uh, it was, it was merely, uh, ano lang, uh, it was really fake na uh, kinalat lang, uh, ginawa ng, ng istorya. Ang sabi ni John Lloyd Chris, um, uh, Uh, ay, ang sabi pala nung, nung, nung representative dun sa hospital na pinantahan nila, John Lloyd, John Lloyd Chris was there to visit his cousin who had, mm-hmm. who had give, who gave birth lang. So, John Lloyd was there with his girlfriend, which is Shaina, and then ginawan lang daw ng issue na, oy, nagpunta sila sa ospital, nakatakip mm-hmm. daw ng kumot. <laughs> yeah. Hindi mo, hindi mo paghiwalay. Uh-uh. Mm, hindi raw mo paghiwalay. Kailangan daw tapunan ng asin. <laughs> Babe naman. I mean, kung tatapunan mo ng asin, ba't dumal- dinala mo pa sa ospital? Lang, <laughs> yun, walang asin yun, sa bahay? That's, that's what Shane said sa isang, sa isang, uh, sa isang interview. If, if, if it, If it was really the first place, they w- they wouldn't go in a public uh public place na na may mga makakakita sa kanila. So, Shane said na sobrang ano lang yun, sobrang bluff, sobrang chismis ginawa ng storya. Pero ito, uh, do you think uh kasi tiba yung luck thing na yan. Naniniwala ka ba? Dyan? Have you, Oo, posible yung nangyari yan. Nakarinig ka rin. Naka, ah, oh. na, nakarinig. Do you know someone or do you know anyone na na, na Personally, na wala. Personally, wala. But, you know, when you try to research, it can really happen. I don't know kung paano naglalak yan. <laughs> wala ah, akong idea. Alam, ah, ako pas, alam ko kung paano naglalak yan eh. Na, personal experience. Hindi ako ha. Para may mga aso kasi kami. Ano 'yan? 
<laughs> sa aso. <laughs> sa aso? Iba naman yung sa aso. Ganon talaga yun. Eh, eh. Okay. Eh, kaya nga eh. Yun nga eh. Ba- ko, ano, same principle eh. Aso. Tao. Oh, ano ba yung ginagawa nila? Di ba parehas lang? Oh, eh, kung... Hindi. Sa aso, ganon talaga yun. Naglalak oh. talaga. <laughs> Naglalak kasi kailangan, kailangan ilak. May gin- <laughs> kaya nga may shooter eh. Di ba? Pag aso, pag istad may shooter. So, kailangan, kailangan mag-effort to, to, para malak. Okay. <laughs> Ngayon, ako, sa, sa personally sa tao, parang imposible. Oh, I, I, I did my research. Oh, meron, meron daw. Pwede daw. Pero, parang, mm-hmm. kahit sa porn, wala eh. Sinurch ko. <laughs> wala rin eh. Kaya, wala, hindi, hindi, parang, imposible eh. Tsaka, Paano, paano yung pag nag-lock? Pa, paano mo i-unlock? <laughs> Password? <laughs> Sabi mo, buhusan lang asin. Eh, paano pag ayaw pa din? Uh, lagariin. <laughs> eh, kawawa ang guy dun, di ba? <laughs> anyway, that's our number five. Again, guys, you're, you're listening to PinoyPodcast.com Topic 49, Top 10, sc- uh, Local Celebrity Scandal in these recent years. So, that was our number five, the John Lloyd Cruz and Shaina Magdayaw Lock Penny Scandal. <laughs> okay. Alright, so, let's move What's on. What's number four? Number four, number four. Number mm-hmm. four. Okay. Ito, um, ito talaga, legit siya na scandal. Pero, maraming nagsabi, ganito to, ganito yan. Siyempre, sa mga celebrity, di ba, um, pag sikat yung lalaki, matipuno, di ba? Bakit bakit ba nila sinasabing bakla? Shan, mm-hmm. is it is it because ano, may mga nang insecure or or they're pwede. too good looking to be called gay? Okay. Yeah, pwede or talagang kasi alam mo naman kung walang walang apoy, walang usok. <laughs> di ba? Tama. Tama. Right. So, are, you, are we talking about the Sam and Piola Pascual scandal? No, 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 no. Kasi Sam and okay. Piola Pascual, lagi lang yung chismis na ganyan daw. Pero hindi naman nila inamin eh. Number four is someone someone that 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 he admitted and actually inano niya talaga, kinarir niya. Guys, number four, Rustong Padilla now. Bibi? Bibi ganda. Yeah. Habi. Scan. Uh-huh. Uh, controversy. Coming out controversy. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's our number four. So, so, ito lang, right? Uh, nung before, yung pangalan niya pa is Rustong Padilla, napapanood ko pa ito eh. Yung, yung mga, uh-huh. yung, nung bata ako, napanood ko pa yung movie nito eh. Maskulado. Tapos, may action pa nga eh. May mga baril pa nga na yung pagbarilan pa. Oo, ano siya, di ba nga, sabi sa FB, from Mista to Sista. Ayun, Mista pala. <laughs> from Mista yeah. to Sista. Uh-huh. <laughs> pero ano di ba pero nung nawala siya sa nawala siya sa line like nawala siya sa, sa showbiz uh, mm-hmm. he went to stick ang sabi mm-hmm. nila sa stick pa lang daw lumabas na daw uh, nag ano na siya uh, unti unti na daw siya nagpaka nagpaka totoo and then in this recent uh, recent years especially the the program that she that he he actually joined. Doon na siya, doon na talaga siya na, ano, na, na umamin. Cause, yeah, so PBB. PBB. PBB, yeah. P- 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 Pinoy Big Brother. Big Brother. Uh-uh. Um- kailangan, oh. kailangan nung, nung umamin siya, kailangan may malaking mariposa. <laughs> may malaking mariposa sa syudad na pumunta sa kanyang town pa sa balikat pa o sa hita. <laughs> mm, yun, yun na yung, ano, yun na yung sign. Uh-huh. Oh, sabi ni Gran Turismo sa US daw kasi you're free to express tama naman especially especially sa mga states na na free ang gay marriage right pwede naman uh-huh. talaga pa, kung ikaw bading ka uh, celebrity ka punta ka dun pakabading ka <laughs> <laughs> okay kaya itong si Bibing Gandang Hari ngayon na sobrang sobrang opposite na sa itsura niya before Oh, uh, ngayon, what, what do you think of him? Is it legit na ba siya na, okay, tanggap ko to, ganto na siya? 
uh, actually sa atin na sa a- ako kasi naabutan ko pa siya na lalaki pero yung sa mga ngayon yung mga kids kilala na siya as ganyan PB so, so uh-huh. it's okay pero for us na na kilala natin siya ah pwedeng pala to dati like what Grant Turismo said sa US okay lang yan ah uh, like merong mga Hollywood actor na oh pwedeng pala but, but no big deal they are gay they, they, someone support uh, na susuportahan pa nga sila di ba pero in mm-hmm. sa Pilipinas na na very conservative uh, country and uh, na hindi pa masyadong actually in alam mo late, kasi ang ang Pilipinas mm-hmm. naman conservative lang na ano eh mm-hmm. They're just conservative na ayaw nilang malaman ng publiko kung ano yung mga pinaggagawa nila sa personal nilang buhay. Pero, ang dami nilang sinasabi about, you know, Ruston Padilla na ngayon ay bibinggandang hari na. Ang dami nilang ano, ang dami nilang comment being um, um, like yung mga iba nag out in the open din na, na lesbians. Ang dami nilang sinasabi. Pero, sa ano, sa, sa circle lang nila, sa sa buhay lang nila, dami rin nilang issues. Conservative lang minsan, hindi naman lahat ng Pilipino, minsan ng Pilipino, conservative lang pagdating sa issues ng ibang tao. Pag sila lang gumagawa, okay na. Tama. Diba? Tama, 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 <laughs> tama, 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 tama. Uh-huh. So, so, so sa'yo, okay lang. Sa akin, okay lang, lang yun eh. I mean, yeah. I mean, hindi ko mabibigay kay Bibi Gandang Hari kung ano ang makakapagpaligaya sa kanya. Walang sino man ang makakapagbigay niyan sa kanya. So, kung saan siya mag- kung saan siya masaya at kung paano siya magiging masaya, then by all means, so supportahan ko siya. Tama. So, so okay lang sa'yo if, if, eto nga, si, si, meron pang si, ito lang, the singer, um, yung to uh, Charis. <laughs> okay lang say that, that she's actually a lesbian after being a girl na lumaki sa TV na babae siya. It's all right, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. So ngayon, ngayon lately sa atin, uh, not unlike before na medyo hindi pa natin tanggap, pero ngayon I think okay na eh. Nag nag uh, ano na eh, nag Ang uh, ano lang diyan. Mm-hmm. Uh Donzi. Ang parang kina-question ko lang din kasi they're nasa industry sila na where where they entertain people. Like in the case of um Cherise Pempenko. Uh Cherise is lumaki lumaki yan in front of the camera say. Eh. Lumaki yan na uh, sa ano ng publiko, right? Um mm-hmm. pinagtatanong ko senior. lang. Okay. Oo, oh, oh, okay lang eh na lesbian ka. I mean Bakit kailangan maging cross-dresser ka pa? Bakit kailangan mag- magdamit <laughs> lalaki ka? Di ba? Ba't kailangan magdamit lalaki ka, maggupit lalaki ka? Have you noticed kung paano na umupo si Charis Pempenko ngayon? Adipo lalaki, adipo. lalaki. Oo, lalaki, lalaki, Dre. Mas, baka nga mas makakasyo pa siyo eh. Hindi, hindi na nga nag-shave ng, ano, eh, ng underarm eh. <laughs> Oo nga, parang... I mean... Lalaki na daw eh. Alam mo ba, when I was like 16 years old, I was at Tia Maria's Green Hills. I was, wow. I was, I was drinking alone sa bar. Anong year yun? Oh, huwag ko nang tanongin ko anong year. <laughs> I was drinking alone sa bar, tapos may lumapit sa akin na, oh, shocks, talagang sexy. Sexy yung babae, maganda. So, I thought she was just being friendly, offering me drinks, ganyan, uh, kasi mag-isa lang din siya. Kasi naka-micro mini, naka-plunging neckline, naka-false eyelashes, naka-red lipstick. We became friends eventually. Oo, oh, oh, maganda siya. We became friends. Tapos, um, pagkatapos nun, what you call this? Pagkatapos nun, di, lagi kami nag-meet sa tia, <laughs> lagi kami nag sa tia Maria. Right. Tapos, one time, nag-CR ako, sumunod siya sa CR. Alam mo, sabi niya, pareho kami nag-lipstick, nakaharap kami sa salamin, ang sabi niya sa akin. What? You know what? I like you. Habang nag-CR kayo? Oo, oh, habang nag-lipstick kami. You know ah, what? I like you. 
Sabi niya, I like you. Pwede ba maging tayo? So, uh, being 16 at that time, medyo na siya, oh my God, she's, she's really sexy and mas maganda pa ata sa akin. And she's lesbian pala. Kaya pala siya nakikipagkaibigan sa akin is because she's a lesbian. So, ayun, dumistan siya na ako. I mean, hindi ba pwedeng ganun yung mga... yung mga ano natin, diba? Yung mga entertainers natin, especially Chess Pempenko or who else na huwag na mag-cross-dresser. Pero, um, kasi, like, Cherise kasi, uh, she she has been exposed sa US. Like, ba diba, for example, she's been, she's been with Ellen. Siguro, naging, na, na, naging ano niya si, ano, si Ellen. Ellen DeGeneres. <laughs> naging idol niya. Kaya, para sa kanya, uh-huh. okay. eto ako eh okay lang but si Ellen ganto so ako rin and and uh, in fairness kay 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 Bibi gandang hari ganun din siya eh. she she he uh, he was he was aware na ganto sa US i can be free so parang if nag itong particular uh, tao na to Charis and Riston they had they had been exposed sa labas kaya siguro pagdating nila dito sa Pilipinas okay lang to wala akong pakialam so ayun Kaya, kaya siguro, siguro okay lang sila mag-cross-dress because public figure naman sila, okay lang. Pero, pero for, for, for normal, for a normal person na, mm-hmm. ano, na isang uh, babae ka, maganda ka, tapos nagko-cross-dress ka, we, we call them butch, di ba? Yung mga tomboy na ganyan. Medyo mm-hmm. nakaka-freak out. Kasi, mas, kasi actually, nung, nung, nung college ako, Uh, meron akong eskwela na pinasukan, pero nag-transfer out din ako. Uh, ano siya? Uh, ay, uh, exclusive for girls siya na school. Tapos, yung, yung batch ko, yung, ako yung third batch na naging co-ed. So, marami pang tomboy sa, ano, sa, sa school. Sobrang mm-hmm. daming tipo. Tapos yung mga tipo rin, since dati siya exclusive school, yung mga tibu din, yung mga magagandang girls, ang mga, ang mga, mga partner nila, yung mga tibo, yung mga tibo na yun, mas, kung umasta sila, mas lalaki pa sila sa amin, sa mga lalaki. Yung, eh, ganun yung, din naman, di ba? Ano, ganun din naman, when, yung mga gay, mas, mas malambot pa talaga, at, mas gay, makende ka, kaysa sa mga naman, babae. Yung tanggap naman eh, kasi, ano eh, yung, pag ganun naman yung mga, may, meron tayong, meron tayong, uh, what you call it, may ano sa kanila eh, tanggap na, na, oh, okay ka, kailangan malambot ka. We, we find that entertaining eh. Okay lang eh. Pero, yung babae, mas maangas pa sa lalaki. Do you find it fun? <laughs> <laughs> na magtalakad. See? Ayan, yan ang sinasabi ko. Yung mga ego nyo na yan. Pinaghahaplos nyo dapat yan. <laughs> So, so in, in, uh, until now, until now, pag nakakita ko ng gano'n na babae, na tomboy na, ta, na, na nagpapakalbo, tapos, tapos rakista dating, malaki t-shirt, <laughs> medyo parang, ano ba eh, ba, bakit ganda to? Pwede naman, pwede, like what you said, pwede naman, ano eh, pwede naman, mag, ano lang, mag babae, tapos you're a lesbian, okay, mas ma-attract mo pa nga yung, ano eh, yung babae, if you're, if you're dressing like that, if you're, you're being decent eh. Pero, hindi rin natin alam eh. Iba-iba talaga eh. Mayroon mga babae, mas na-attract sila sa ganun style. Yung mga butch. <laughs> yung mga yeah. lalaki pa sa lalaki. So, ewan ko. No, grabe. Iba-iba talaga ang mga... Iba-iba talaga ang mga... Mga trip nowadays. <laughs> ah, ganun. Oh, ano number na ba tayo, Tanzi? That's number... Four. Okay. Guys, again, you're listening to Pinoy Podcast. Topic for tonight, uh, top 10 local celebrity scandal of these recent years. All right, so let's move on to number three and number two, and then we're gonna take a break, and then we're gonna expose the number one. Ano, Tonzi, pwede ba, Tonzi, pwede ba bumate? Uh, sure, 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 bati ka muna. Yeah, I'm just, I just want to greet Leah, who's, She's home right now and she's listening and Hi, to, to Rama, to Hello. Marianne, Hello. Um, to Gay, to Gay, okay, um, to D, to to Ala, to Bombi, to Annie. They're listening right now. Hi guys. 
Hi guys, okay. thank you, thank okay. you for tuning in. Okay. So, so yeah, uh, batiin ko rin yung batiin ko rin ulit yung mga listener natin sa sa website. Uh, Lindsay, Drew, and JDC. Well, Grand Turismo said BRB. So, yeah, let, let's move on. Iwan na natin okay. si Grand Turismo. <laughs> okay. Alright, the, the, actually guys, the number three and the number two, uh, napag-usapan na siya dito sa podcast. Eh. Sobrang, uh, syempre ngayon, mas, uh, kaya, siya, kaya siya nasa top ten natin. Kasi in this recent years, let's say two years or three years, even yung mga bata, yung mga bata, na-expose na sila online. Can you imagine, um, uh, Six years old, seven, marunong na yan mag-internet, right? Yes, yes. So, itong mga to, itong mga scandal na to, kung lumabas sila, let's say, seven or eight years ago, yung mga bata, hindi naman to magiging ganito ka, ka big deal, eh. ka, magiging kasikat, magiging controversial. Pero, since ngayon, <laughs> since sobrang dami ng, since yung, kahit yung mga bata, mga gusugusin, marunong na mag-online, Um, madali nilang ma-spread. Ma- What I mean is, gusgusin yung, yung, yung naglalaro pa. Ng, yung, yung, alam mo yun, yung dapat, dapat nag, nag, ano sila, naglalaro sila sa labas, pero, pero in their, in their, uh, in their pastime, nag-internet sila. Nagpupuyat sila para mag-net. Supposedly, hindi naman dapat. Kasi nung bata ko, wala namang ganun, di ba? Okay. Right. So, alam so, mo, alam, alam mo, Tonzi, wag mo na akong pitinin. Masakit na yung puson ko. Yeah, ano yung yeah, item na yan? <laughs> okay. Right, right. So, number number three actually is, has been, has been, uh, has been posted here in Pinay Podcast. Ah, no, no, no. Actually, that was number two. The number three is the, the, the Wally Bayola scandal. What do you think of ah. this, Shen? Right. Actually, well, uh, Alright, let, okay. let, let me say something first. Ah, uh, yung, yung the Wally Bayola scandal actually. Kung kung dati pa siya na ilabas, that's that's nothing. That's a uh, 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 celebrity scandal in the man. Okay, wala ganyan lang yan. Ikakalat lang siya tas, and then mawawala. Pero now, bakit siya bakit siya naging sobrang controversy? Because ano eh, because yun nga, like what I said earlier, madali siyang na-spread out eh. Kinalat lang eh. Kinalat ng kinalat ng kinalat ng kinalat. Hanggang everyone knows na. Kahit yung mga ano konting ano share ay na andiyan na that's the that's the first part the, the, the second part is uh this is actually a pre- uh may asawa siya right uh the Wally is uh, siyang asawa and then uh she had uh he had intercourse with with someone else so so basically hindi yun pwede right so yun na, yun ang maging yun ang yun ang issue dun the 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 the, the The, having intercourse with someone else now, you know, you're married, hindi pwede. So, what do you think? Is it, do, do they deserve to be in, on the number three? <laughs> <laughs> yes, kasi, um, at first, when I first heard that, hindi rin ako, si Wally, may, may scandal? Really? Or is this a joke? So, I go to the... I go searching and nakita ko nga na, oh wow, it's true. Na may, may scandal nga siya. And the, I don't know if it's true, ah, but the last oh, time I kasi... heard, hindi, mm-hmm. ibig sabihin, the last time I heard, um, yun nga, correct me if I'm wrong, I stand to be corrected, that right. it was actually Yosh that uploaded mm-hmm. the video. I, I don't know, I'm not, uh... Is it, is it Yosh? I don't know if it's true, ha, yung nabasa ko. Um, kasi parang they were really into a relationship and okay. and um, Wally was um, parang tumatalikod na siya, ayaw na niya. So, bilang gante, uh-huh. parang in-upload ni Yosh yung video. Mm, pero sobrang anong usual yun eh. 'Di ba? Kasi usually ang 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 ano natin ang ang pag may ganyang kumalit na video, usually the, the guy the guy do that. The guy the guy spread it out. The guy the guy is the is the reason why. <laughs> pero alam ngayon, mo, al- like what you said, babae pala si Yosh. 
Oo, alam mo kasi, Tonsi, ang mga babae, lahat ng pagpapasensya gagawin namin, lahat ng understanding gagawin namin. Pero pag yan nagalit, aba, matindi pa sa tigre yan. Tama, tama. I, I understand. Pero, pero to the point na pati yung Kasi, di ba, Pap? Yan nga, Let's... eh. Kasi gusto niya kaawaan siya. Alam mo yon Gusto niya siguro, hindi ko rin alam, ma. I, I mean, hindi ko alam kung tama ba yung nabasa ko. But if nga, natotoo to, parang ang lumalabas dyan is, huh? ang lumalabas dyan is, um, talagang ito, she's into revenge talaga na sisirain niya kung anong meron si Wally. If not to get him back, just to get his attention. Pwede. Diba? Pero, pero, pero she's aware naman that, that, that he's married. So, having a, having a fear with someone, Yun nga. hindi, hindi uh-huh. na legal, right? Uh, it could be yeah. what, adultery or, or whatever. Hindi, hindi siya pwede. So, so paano siya magiging understanding? Eh. Kailangan maging understanding siya that Yun nga, dumating, dumating, dumating na siya doon sa punto na yung pagmamahal niya, sobra-sobra na na hindi niya matanggap na kahit kailan si Wally hindi magiging kanya. Dumating na siya doon sa punto na mas matapang pa siya kaysa doon sa legal na asawa. But, we'll never know. Pero bakit ganun ba yung mga babae? Like, uh, may, mga, may mga ganang uh, babae talaga. No, no, I mean, bakit ganun ang babae pag ganun yung sitwasyon? Pardon? Like, uh, bakit ganun yung mga babae pag ganun ng sitwasyon? Like, you're being kabit or you're you're just, you're just, ano, alam mo yun? Uh, having a fear, a fear for, from someone na uh, married. Okay. Bakit sila nagiging uh, pushy? Bakit nila Kasi pinipilit ganito yan, eh. kailangan? Kasi ganito, ganito yan. Okay, guys. Guys, you listen for for all those who's listening right now. Kung ikaw lalaking may asawa ka at um maglalaro ka ng apoy. Sisiguraduhin mo na yung kalaro mo, alam yung position yung dalawa. Okay? Um dapat ilahad mo, ilahad mo na ito tayo, hanggang dito lang tayo, ito lang yung boundaries natin, ito lang ang pwede mong gawin, ito lang ang pwede kong gawin, ito lang ang pwede natin gawin sa loob ng relasyon natin to. Siguro, kaya minsan, yung mga ibang mistress, mas matapang pa, kaysa dun sa legal na asawa, kasi itong si ano, itong si lalaki, itong uh-huh. si lalaki, nag ano na rin, nag, uh, what do you call this, um, hindi niya talaga, mini-mislead niya yung babae. You know, pinapaasa niya na one day I'd live my wife for you. We're not really okay. Parang ganon. So, ito, umasa. Umasa si Kabet. Tapos, si Yosh. Bigla na lang. Oo, hindi. Hindi man si Yosh. Kung kahit sino man, di ba? Umasa si Kabet. Tapos, isang araw, sasabihin niya lalaki, hindi ko pala kayang iwan ng family ko. And ito ka na. Ito si Kabet. Hulog na hulog na sa'yo. So, talaga makakapag-isip ka ng ano, ng hindi maganda. So, so from the very start of the relationship, kung ito man, ang, ito man ay extramarital affair, uh, uh, dapat yeah. malinaw sa magkabilang panig kung hanggang, hanggang saan lang. lang. Oo, okay. kung hanggang saan, kung hanggang ano ang pwede, yes. Para ano, di ba, walang sasihan. Ginusto mo to, ginusto ko. Let's play. That's the rule of rule of thumb pag if you're having an affair hindi namin tinato- uh, ke- we're not tolerating affair na- we're just being uh, kaya lang natin yes you're not, you're not tolerating you're not tolerating affair pero you're enjoying it di ba? <laughs> oh <laughs> enjoy oh. enjoy 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 kaya ayaw mo makinig yung kaya ayaw mo makinig yung girlfriend mo <laughs> <laughs> alright number two <laughs> Okay, number two. <laughs> Let's move on to number two. Pero bago yung number two, <laughs> si JDC, kaya tanong niya, gano'n daw kaliit yung weapon ni Wally? <laughs> Actually, hindi ko nakita eh. Ay, na, 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 mga si JDC, sa iba nakafocus eh. <laughs> Just kidding. Kasi, anyway, okay. pero you know, pero you know, this Wally, Wally Yosh thing, di ba, 
we all know before the scandal we we, we are aware na, na parang wali is a bi or parang gay tapos biglang lumabas uh, may scandal pala to yun nagaan sila sa video parang uy lalaki pala to <laughs> <laughs> parang sa pride ni Wario oh, eh alam niyo na lalaki pala ako oh, eh okay lang sa akin yan pero bakit ba- basihan ba yon basihan ba yon pwede, na... pwede basihan yon if you if you're a public figure tapos uh, yung public uh, hinuhusga ka oh bading 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 pala to bading pala to ang dami naman kayang bading na public figure, figure. din na may anak like like who? <laughs> ah, dami ah, yeah 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 like, o- like o- o- GDS, diba? o- GDS. Ogidias. Oh, Ogidias ah. Alam mo ba one time? Sorry, out of the topic lang. Ogidias. Alam mo ba sobrang cool nitong bading na to? <laughs> na, nakasakay ko siya one time. And ano 2007 ata to 2008. Oh. Uh, uh, yung first work ko is in Makati. May uh, nakasakay ko to si Ogidias sa sa MRT. Mm. Galing siya ng GMA. Tas um uh, Kilgo ata sa 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 Makati. Tapos uh, nakatabi ko siya sa Bali siya nakatayo. Ako nakaupo. Tapos din sa MRT na 'yon, uh, mainit, mainit, hindi masyadong magana yung aircon that time. <laughs> Tapos meron siya, merong guy doon na sabi, "Oh, gee, oh, oh eh, si ano 'yan, 'di ba? Ganun ganun." Tapos one time, uh, out of nowhere, bigla na lang may umamoy na na mabaho sa MRT. Mm-hmm. <laughs> tapos yung guy na yun yung guy na nagsasabi na oh si Ogie Ogie bigla ba namang tinuro si <laughs> Ogie Diaz na oy ikaw ba yung yung nagfart ang baho eh <laughs> tapos <laughs> okay Diaz, binara niya yung binara niya yung lalaki sabi nung <laughs> sabi ni sabi ni Ogie Diaz sa lalaki ah manong tignan nyo naman yung suot nyo ope naka sleeveless kayo baka kayo yung ano baka kayo yung mabaho Okay. <laughs> tapos ang simula nung simula nung sa 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 station din sa GMA mula nung nag nag-usap nag-asaran sila hanggang Makati. Parang naging ano yung usapan nila, naging asaran lang. Tapos lahat ng tao ro nagtatawa na lang kasi OGDS is just being himself, being being funny. So sobrang sobrang okay tong gay na to. Pero back to the topic, yung yung sinasabing mong sobrang daming gay. Pero sobrang daming gay. na you think men na celebrity pero hindi umaami na gay. Mm-hmm. 'Di ba marami? Mm-hmm. Sabi mo nga like Piolo and some. <laughs> Sabi nga ni JDC Piolo eh. <laughs> okay, and the number tayo, number two? The, the, all right, all right. Let, let, let's move on to number two. So yeah, that's number three. Wally Bayola scandal. Number two, it has been posted in uh, podcast.com recently. Of course, uh, the Chito Miranda and Neri Naik scandal. Uh, I know, guys. Na pag-usapan na to. Uh, na you guys have, have uh, talk and exchange thoughts about it, but but still very popular, right? Uh, they deserve in their top ten. list. Uh, ito lang ah uh, ako uh, personally uh, um, what do you think uh, personally I, pag kumalat yung ako kunyari uh, celebrity ako and then kumalat tong video na to but uh, I meet my girlfriend and she's hindi kami uh, I love her so much tapos Kumalat yung video, walang walang bago. We're, we're still together. We just know that uh, this this might be just a challenge. Um, uh, ma ma malalampasan din natin to. I I will marry you. Tayo pa rin. As as for me, as long as uh as long as uh the girl the girl is anjan, hindi siya affected. Uh she's being herself, just loving me. Whatever happens, then. I think hindi siya magiging big deal for me as a guy who who has been involved in a scandal. Pero for you as a woman, can can you stand it? Like uh, public figure ka, you're or let's say you're a normal person, tas may lumabas sa scandal na kayo. Pero you still you still you you guys are still okay. You guys are still uh, are still going out. Walang problema. Lumabas to okay. Lumabas. Walang anong gagawin natin ang janayan. Is it alright? Can you stand it? What do you think, Shen? Yeah, woman. I mean, 
Sa akin, ano naman yun eh. Basta, you know, nandiyan yung lalaki para sa akin na kasangkot doon sa scandal. I mean, uh, as long as nagmamahalan kayo. di ba? Love conquers pero, all. Pero what? Pero paano kung... Uh, l- 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 uh, let's let's be uh, let's be real. Paano kung kung merong mga let's say mga ka office mate, mga colleagues, kapit bahay, neighbors, si sabi, oy ganyan, ganyan yan. They they're being judge judgmental. Uh, okay. No siya mm-hmm. kanila. So paano yun? Are, are you are you does does it uh, does it, uh, affect the relationship? No, hindi yun maapektuhan ng yung sa akin ha, sa personality ko kahit ano man sabihin ng mga kapitbahay ko, ng mga nakakakilala sa akin, kahit ano man maging tingin nila sa sarili ko, hin- sa sa akin hindi yan ano eh, hindi yan makakaapekto doon sa pagtingin ko doon sa relationship. Doon sa relationship ko with the guy. I mean, I don't, I won't give a damn. I, I won't give a hell. What the heck? What the hell? Sabihin yung gusto nyong sabihin, okay? I mean, sige, for, for, for a while, sige, ma-entertain kayo. Pag-usapan nyo ko. Pag-usapan nyo yung katawang ko. <laughs> <laughs> diba? Sagarin nyo yan hanggang, hanggang, hanggang gusto nyo. Pero, hanggang that, won't, yan, eh? <laughs> that won't bring me down. I mean, walang, walang yeah. epekto sa akin yung mga ganyan. As long as nandun, as long as nandun si Chito and nagmamahalan kami, mm. di ba? Walang mm. issue doon. Tama. So, so th- that's actually what's happening right now. Chito and Neri is un- handling the issue well. Uh, mm. uh, they're not being affected and... Tuloy lang. Uh, Chito is Chito. Is Chito. Uh, he's an institution, di ba? Rockstar. Talagang, knowing mm-hmm. him, y- yung banda naman na, they're all silly. So, lumabas naman to. Alam naman yung image na ganito, medyo silly itong mga to. Okay lang. That's the scandal. Or, uh, I still have my girlfriend. I still have my music. Okay lang. Yeah, kasi ka, ano naman eh. Yun, yun, lang, yun nga lang yung pinagkaiba nila sa... Wally and Yosh scandal, mm, diba? Mm, mm, they're, they're there for each other and like Wally na naka-house arrest ata si Wally. Hindi <laughs> <laughs> na lumabas ng bahay. <laughs> Oo. <laughs> Nasa bahay na lang. <laughs> diba? Yun yung mahirap doon. Yun din, kawawa din si Yosh doon. I mean, ganun talaga eh. That's life. And saka, ano pa ba naman ng bago dyan? Lahat naman ng tao nakikipag-sex, ba? Diba? It's just so happy Pero na lumabas na yan. Pero hindi lahat ng tao nagbibideo. <laughs> Oo oh, nga, it's Pero, just so happy na lumabas yan. So Pero wala may, naman na may, dapat sabi ko yung shoot din eh. Yeah. Pero like, in fairness nga dun kay Chito and, ano, and Neri, they, they, instead of uh, blaming each other, no? alam mo yun, they just move on. Hindi niya na, oh, ba't ba kumalat to? Ba't ba ganito? Uh-uh. Kasi... Kasi meron silang sinabi, uh, Chito tweeted, diba, na sabi niya, uh, hard drive was, was stolen. Do you think mm-hmm. niya magnanakaw? Oh, uh, uh, are you, are you, are you, are you, uh, are you agree na, uh, or do you agree na, na, na ninakaw lang yung hard drive? Alam mo kung ano man yung dahilan nila, palusot na lang nilang siguro yun, yeah. bahala <laughs> sila sa buhay nila. Kasi magnanakaw yun. Magnanakaw, hindi siya naman alam yung hard drive. <laughs> diba? May magnanakaw, may magnanakaw bang o oh, hard drive to USB to? Uh, baka may laman ito. <laughs> hindi man lang Okay. But anyway, yun yung number to natin. But uh, guys, before before we we, we reveal number one, uh, I'm gonna ask our listener, uh, hulaan nyo guys, ano yung number one natin? I'm sure, I'm sure yeah. meron makakula nito. Especially, the, the, especially the, the listener in our in our website pinaypodcast.com again guys uh uh you're listening to 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 our premiere premiere ep- episode for for late night show with Tansi it's uh uh the topic is top 10 local celebrity scandal so we're going to play some music before we reveal number 1 while we're playing the song we're going to ask this guy uh, if uh, if aning number one natin. Alright, so Shan, are you here? Yeah, I'm here. 
So okay, where's our where's our technician? G, are you there? I'm here. Pakatulog ka na dyan, ha? <laughs> Hindi, paano ako matutulog? Eh, ang init ng topic niyo. <laughs> okay, so guys, we'll, we'll be going to pause for a break. Um, You can make hula of item number one. You post it in the chat box. <laughs> sure, I'm sure mahula niya. Uh-uh, and we will be right back. Okay? So... What, Tanzi? It's 11.05, Manila, check. Philippines. Yes, it's a Saturday night. Good morning, Bye. New York. Yeah. Good morning.
And we're back on the premiere episode of Late Night with Tonzi. You're listening hey to the podcast. And here's the main man, Tonzi. Hi, guys. Hi, Sharon. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. And... Yeah. May nabasa na ako sa chat box na nakahuli ng item number one. Oh. Ah, talaga? <laughs> yeah. It's JDC. JDC. <laughs> Talaga right. katong so, si JDC so, so, updated. Hmm, updated dyan. Um, right Pero ano eh? Tonsi, ikaw daw idol mo eh. Paano ka ako naging idol? Ikaw daw ang idol mo eh. Sila ang idol oh, ko. Oo, oh, oh, sabi kanina, habang hindi pa tayo on air, nagbabasa ako sa chat box, nag-uusap-usap kayo. Ikaw daw yung idol nila. Uh, anong part? <laughs> Lahat daw ata ng bawal at masarap na tikman mo na. <laughs> Oo, oh, pagkain. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> so food, may ilig tayo kumain. Anyway, ano yung anyway, bawal? Anyway, anyway, anyway. <laughs> Parang pa, bawal umihi. Nasubuhan. Bakit ganito? Bakit ganito mga co-host ko dito sa PinoyPodcast.com? Mga co-host ko na lalaki, si G, si Tonzi, kapag na, ah, ano, iwas agad. Pero pag kayo, tinitira nyo ako, okay lang. <laughs> Ikaw daw ang prinsesa eh. Kaya gano'n. <laughs> Hindi, rey na ako. <laughs> anyway guys, uh, let, 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 let's move on. Let's move on to, to, to our number one. But, but, but before we reveal our number one, we, we're, gonna, uh, we're gonna summarize the the tally from 10. Okay. Oh, sige na, right? isummarize, isummarize mo na yan. Iwas po soy Tonzi. <laughs> Alright guys, again, you're listening to Top 10 Local Pinoy Celebrity Scandal and Slash Controversy. Alright, here goes, here, here it goes, number 10 from our number 10 to 2 before we reveal our number 9. Again, number 10 is the Sharon Coneta Billboard Controversy and the number 9 is Chris Aquino STD Scandal. Our number 8 is the Ethel Buba Video Scandal. Uh, our number seven is the Claudine and Montulfo, Claudine and Company, and the Mon- and Montulfo boxing match. <laughs> our number six is Rian Ramos and Mo scandal, uh, controversy about abortion and and kissing, whatever say YouTube. And our uh, our special list five point five mahal <laughs> <Yeah>. scandal. <laughs> Ako <laughs> doon. Mami, Our, 5.5 pa. Uh, shower. So guys, yung mga hindi pa nakapanood nung kay Mahal o yung hindi kilala si Mahal, sa, you, sa YouTube meron yun. Search nyo lang. Okay yun. <laughs> Alright, our number 5, the Penis Captivus scandal. But, um, alleged lang to ah. It might be fake. It could be real. We don't know. It's between Shane and John Lloyd. Alright, the number four is uh, the gandang <laughs> Bibi Gandang Hari coming out. Where okay. Filipinos were really shocked when Rizam Padilla came out. And number three, the Wali Bayola Yash scandal. Number two, Chito Miranda scandal. Alright, so, uh, nawala na ni JDC ang number one, no? The number one, of course, the Hayden Co. Sex Scandal series. <laughs> May series to eh. Yes, yes. Ganda, ang dami nito eh. Uh-huh. Alright, that, that's our number one because ano kasi eh, talagang, talagang number one siya eh. Hindi mo siya pwede gawing number two eh. Mm-hmm. Kasi, kasi matindi talaga eh, di ba? So, kasi biruin mo, you're, you're, you're a celebrity. You're a doctor. Tapos, you're, you're a good-looking man. No? Kung, kung, ah, guwapo. Kung, kung, no? Kung, 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 kung I was, uh, I was a gay and may manly crush ako. That would be hating ko. Pero, hindi ako bading eh. <laughs> so, pero, napansin, yung, pero napansin mong guwapo siya. Eh, hindi rin. Hindi rin. So, may tendency. Kasi, uh, wala, walang tendency. Kaya sabi ko, hindi rin. Eh. Diba? Okay. Pero, idol, idol ko lang siya. Idol ko lang siya. Kasi, di ba, da, dami niya. Especially, the, the girl, Maricar. Sobrang number one talaga yun. Yun yung hit eh. Medyo natabunin niya pa nga yung ibang ka-ano niya eh. Ka-do eh. Kasi, yung kay Maricard, the best eh. <laughs> diba? Uh, have you watched this? Have you watched all the series? Sure. Yes. So, what do you think? What do you think? Uh, of course, it deserve number one, right? Uh, do you agree with me? Mm-hmm. Pero, okay. pero, 
sa, sa series na napanood mo, uh, Hayden with Marika, Hayden with Katrina, Hayden with with a foreign girl, can you, can you, uh, can you tally it from, from ano, uh, who should be the number one? And who should be the number two? And who should be the number three? <laughs> I think, you, that, alam mo, huh? alam mo siguro, sa lahat, sa lahat talaga, yung, yung, sa parte ng scandal, it would be Marie Carr. Pati dun sa outcome, it would be Marie Carr. Pati dun sa moving on, it would be Marie Carr. Pati dun sa after, after moving on, si Marie Carr eh. She was, Very cool all throughout the the issue. Tama, she tama, is tama. very cool, you know. After having been through all this and ended up marrying Richard Poon, mm-hmm. she was very cool. Sabi ni JD, si explain ko raw. El, uh, elaborate ko daw kung bakit si Maricar daw ang best sa akin. <laughs> Alam mo, JD, si we Alam did mo, not JD, elaborate. Si Mm, yung yung sagot ni JDC sagot ko din yun eh. Hindi kasi we did not elaborate why Marie Car is the best. Kasi this is this this pinoypodcast.com we had like um ano na ba? 200 more than followers and ang dami nang nakinig, more than 3,000 na. So We did not. Baka makalating to doon sa mga taong involved. So, we, we might just be, you know, a little bit careful about this. Diba? But, pero, s- sige, pag-usapan natin. Sa performance, it was Marie Carr for me. At saka And, sa tura, it's Marie Carr. It's Marie Carr. Pero, uh, bakit? Mo, Kasi, Marie Carr is, ano eh, yung typical na gusto ng mga lalaki. She, she's petite. She's slim. Pero, she's, she's, she's very hot. ba? Diba? She she's mm-hmm. she's alright. She she's good in she's good performance level. Tama. Ganun. Tapos she's she's I I believe she's a doctor as well, right? Yeah. Mm, so ano pa hanapi mo? And Marika is really pretty. I mean, dati yeah. pa lang nakita ko na siya sa mga commercial eh. Siya pala yung commercial din sa sa facial wash ba yun or or, or whatever. So she she's beautiful. Um uh, all in all, kaya kaya oh. I can't elaborate, pero, pero, that's it eh. Magand, maganda si Marie Carr. Saka she's ano, saka, than... hindi lang yun eh, na she's, she's the prettiest, she's the ano, ang ano dito is, among, among the ladies that were involved in this issue, si Marie Carr ang naging pinaka-triumphant. Tama. That's right. I agree. Siya yung talagang, siya yung, yung lumabas at uh, lumabas ng, you know, nakataas ang noo na wala kong pakailam sa inyo. Ganon. Siya yun. So, talagang na-handle niya ng, ano, ng maayos yung sitwasyon, hindi siya nagpadala. At mas sumigat pa nga siya eh, dahil doon. Oo nga. Oo nga. Y- yun yung, yun yung, that's the irony, di ba? Pa- merong mga, merong mga babae. Pero ang ano dito, ay, mga... naging, public figure na sumisikat sila after after some incident. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. Go ahead, ahead, go ahead. Ang, ang naging isang ano lang nito kay Marie Carr is kasi nasubay ba yan kayong love story niya with Richard Poon? <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. Pagtapos kasi, ng series ni may, yung kasunod pa? Oo, kasi um, gusto talaga ni Richard Poon si Marie Carr. Mm-hmm. Kaya lang nag Lagi siyang on and off tong si Richard Poon kasi iniisip nga niya yung skandal na nangyari. Kung pakakasalan ba niya at makahalin niya si Maricar, kaya niya bang tanggapin yun sa buong married life nila na parang multo ito na babalik at babalik. So, binigyan ni Maricar si Richard Poon ng ultimatum. What ultimatum? Na... Ano ba? Parang um, pag pag we're getting closer na bigla ka mawawala tapos pag na mismo ako babalik ka na naman tapos mawawala ka na naman. Now now this is the last straw sabi ni Maricar. It's either you love me. Binigyan na ng taning. Yeah. Mm. And nung, nung nawala si Maricar, doon na realize ni Richard po na no matter what happens pala kahit ano nangyari, mahal niya si Maricar. Well, I, I, I'm 
Tapos with, with, ano eh, with, with Chirk pun talaga eh. Kahit, kahit na, after all, after all, na, ganun nang nangyari, he still stood up na, I, I love this woman. It's same thing with Cheater and, and Neri. Parang mm-hmm. sa, so, if, if you guys are, are really, are real, Pero ikaw, Kanzi, natan mo yung kita. Yeah. Diba, ang pinaka talagang naging controversial dito ay yung case, yung eksena ni Katrina Halili. Ah, uh, ah, uh, actually, let's see. Do you think Kasi, she deserved uh, that? Do you think she deserved that? I mean, uh, knowing that, that Hayden is in a relationship with Vicky Velo. Kasi yung uh, kay Maricar at kay Hayden, wala pa sa eksena si Vicky Velo. Uh, uh, talagang uh, sila yung mag, 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 mag-boyfriend doon. Unlike with Katrina, na, you know, alam niyang nandiyan si Vicky, tapos si Vicky pa ay endorser, endorser siya ng Bello Company, right? So, mm. parang talagang ang nangyari, talagang kawa, kawa, Vicky Bello oh. was hurt. Actually, kawawa rin talaga si ano rito eh, si, si Katrina, kasi, ano, uh, let's say, no, walang babae na na deserve to be filmed while doing inappropriate things, right? Yun yung una. Second, hindi walang babae na gusto maging kapit. Or someone, someone na, na siya tain ka kahit na may, meron akong ibang partner. W- wala eh. So, wala! So, eh, ba- bakit pumayag si Katrina? Because of, because of, because it's hidden ko. Diba? Hindi naman magiging ganun yung babae. Kung, kung walang effort na ginagawa si Aiden ko like for example okay you're you're good looking uh, I'm uh, let's say I'm good looking tas may may partner ako tas may iba akong gustong babae syempre mag effort ako if gusto kitang gusto kitang uh-huh. makasama makadate or makasama in bed mag effort ako mm-hmm. I, I I would approach you okay. I don't care if I'll approach you uh uh in what whatever manner I would want to like uh-huh. Kahit ano, uh, whatever so, um, means, I'll approach you. So, so, so sabihin, ito, babae lang eh. Katrina is just a girl. Eh. Katrina is just a woman. She's just being a woman. She's just being weak. So, itong oh, guy no. na to, oh, no. good-looking I beg to guy. Disagree. I beg to, di- I beg uh, to disagree, Mr. Tonzi. Huh? You know, hindi sa kinakampihan ko si Hayden ko, right? Sinasabi mo, kaya nagkaganito to, kasi si, si Hayden is talagang mm-hmm. binorso niya si Katrina. Kahit na that, that, that he's involved. That could be it. That could be it. Kahit na he's... Teka lang, patapusin mo ako. Kahit na he's... <laughs> kahit right, na go, he's... Go, go, go. You know, go. he's committed with with Vicky Bello. Mm-hmm. Binorso niya si Katrina. Ang ang pinupunto mo kasi, kaya nang ganun, kaya nang kaganto to, dahil kay Hayden ko. Ang sa akin mm-hmm. lang, kunwari ako si Katrina, Eh, alam ko nga eh, na may, may commitment siya sa iba. Naiwasan saan ang lahat ng to kung hindi rin ako bumigay. Mm-hmm. Uh, th- diba? Point. You're just being weak. No, it's not being weak. That's being makate. <laughs> Uy, bawal daw magsalita ng ganyan. Ano masama? I mean, we, mapababae man or mapalalaki, we should not start itching for something we are not ready to scratch. Pero, pero, the, alam mo ba, that's a human nature. Kasi, eh, hindi. <laughs> sa issue kasi nila eh, kita mo. Alam niya, na committed, Dr. Vicky Bello, na, na what you call this, na, uh, endorser pa, ganyan. Oh, tapos, Ngayon, nung lumabas yung issue, iyak, iyak siya ngayon? Eh, hindi pa ginusto rin naman niya yun? <laughs> Ayaw mo, hindi eh, ba ba akong kakampihan dito? Kinakampihan ng akta? I mean, the way, it's not, it's not about Hayden ko. Nandun na ako, given na yun, Hayden ko, it's a heart rub, it's really guap, it's really good looking, he's a doctor. Pero kung ikaw, kung meron kang respeto sa sarili mo, ba? Work ethics, katrabaho mo si Vicky Bello, um, hindi naman konsensya. Ano bang tawag doon? Hindi ko mahagilap yung, hindi ko mahagilap yung ano, diba? Hindi ko rin alam. Sa puntong ito, hindi naging, hindi pagiging mahina ang, uh, ng isang babae ang naging issue, kundi yung pagiging makate. Okay, okay, fair enough. <laughs> 
<laughs> Tuwang-tuwa si Shanda lang. Oo nga eh. Basta katihan. Tuwang-tuwa na. <laughs> Sorry ah. Comment lang ako. Okay. Anyway, be- being weak is different from being makate ah, guys. That's, that's uh-huh. totally different sa girls. So, ayun. That's, that's it. Nangyari na yan eh. If, if, uh, Maricar and Katrina were, were both victim of this, uh, of this scandal. Sobrang grabe to. That, that's why it is our, our number one in the list of top 10. So, guys, time check lang tayo. The, the current time in Manila is 11.17pm and New York time is 11.17am. So, that's it, basically. That's our, our top 10 for tonight. And, Shan? G? What? Guys? <laughs> You know, uh, it's been a hot oh, night. Dami, uh, oh, dami, dami pa sa controversies, right? Um, yep, yep. The numbers yep, are you know, endless, talaga. But I would like to give it to you, Tanti. Good job for your first night. Right, right, right. And why don't you invite them again over on Saturday, next Saturday? Guys, uh, by the way, the, to our live listener and to all friends of, of, of uh, DJ Shandela who is listening right now, uh, the late night Tonsi would be uh, would be regularly uh, in in Pinoy podcast, right? G or or the other one? Hello. Yeah, it will be. No, uh, it will be on Pinoy podcast when it's live. Yes. Yeah. But you will have your own page on podcastfilipinas.com. All right, right. Along with other podcasts. Mm. So, kanina meron kayong discussion about gays, right? Mm-hmm. And I would like to let the audience know that we will have a podcaster who will represent that sector. I'm excited about this, yes. Yes, and um, he's quite, or she's quite, a controversial uh, G, G. Like personality on Facebook. G. Yes. I hope I hope one time I can go on board with with him. What, yeah. what, what's his? I know. Uh, it's gonna be exciting. He, uh, he's or she's um, Manny Marinai. All right, all right. He, so guys, abangan natin yun. He's a, yeah. He's he. How do we address well, him? Na lang, him. Kasi lalaki naman siya talaga, right? Yeah. I mean, him. Yeah, him. Yeah. That's the proper way. I mean, I'm sorry if I called him her or she. But yeah. Because you know what? I need some education in, in political correctness. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so maybe she, he can do that. You know? Educate us. Okay. And he's quite... A controversial uh, personality. Mm-hmm. Medyo... He thinks the way, the same way as Shandela. Mm. Th- that's great. That's that's uh, a yeah. great additional in our team. Yeah, yeah. So, the Tonsi show is gonna be on podcast Filipinas. Same schedule, right? Uh, every yeah. Saturday, yeah. ten p.m. But if... when you go live, mm-hmm. it will be on penepodcast.com slash live. Okay. Yep, yep, yep. So guys, uh, narinig nyo naman yung sinabi ni Coach G. It's gonna be in podcastpilipinas.com but when it's live, it's gonna be in pinaypodcast.com live. Again, it's be it's gonna be uh, regular every Saturday 10pm. Or, I think we, we can on air ng mas maaga. Eh. Pero, yeah, that's that's the time. Uh, 10pm Saturday. Alright? Thank and you guys. we will post your schedule mm-hmm. on pinaypodcast.com and podcastfilipinas.com so they can they can go to both sites mm-hmm. and they will not lose you yeah that's... and Tonzi how can they contact you uh, guys you can contact me through Skype uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna type the Skype uh, later sa chat box and sa website kasi hindi ko siya memorize but right now we I have an email I'm gonna I'm gonna uh, say the email it's Tonzi at pinaypodcast.com right yes alright yeah, uh, yeah. You, you can okay. you can hit me an email of whatever kahit anong anong or kung gusto niyo mag guest uh, sa sa late night show pwede yung mga kung 
kung gusto niyo maging co-host, pwede, pwede. Just just please let me know. Just please uh, just uh let Shannon and Gino as well. So yeah. Okay. Yeah, and G, I would just like to and then to to thank uh, all the the likers and the people inside the Shandala page. Ah, uh, what <laughs> yes. no? Congratulations. Yes. Congratulations. And so we will have a Tonzi Facebook fan page. <laughs> Thank you. Yes. Yes. Ayun, pag may pag may nag nagkaroon ng fan page pala, you you can you can conveniently and much easier for you guys to to message me. So yeah, yeah. pwede pwede pwede. All right guys, yung yung yes. the, the this is my my first ever uh premier uh program dito sa pinaypodcast.com. So thank you lots uh sa mga nakinig sa live audience Lindsay Druish JDC and Grand Turismo left na eh. so anyway but also sa friends ni Coach G and friends ni Shan uh, thank you thank you guys I, I hope you guys enjoyed the, the, the program tonight and again Tanzi, the, I have a hmm? question right is this your first time podcasting uh, no 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 when I was uh, when I was in college uh, I did pero sinipa ako kasi nakapagmura ako <laughs> <laughs> on air. Because <laughs> that was ano eh, that was a sports uh I was a sports mm. uh jockey. So oh, okay. meron kaming short short story lang ah. Meron kaming mm. uh, yung team namin, uh merong isang guy doon na uh, nang school namin. Meron player kami na nag ano siya ball hog. Hindi niya pinasa yung ball kaya mm-hmm. kami natalo. So sinisi ko oh. yung guy na yon sa on air sa okay. school namin. Eh, yung school namin, Catholic school. So, yeah. Sabi ko, ah, blah, 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 bakit ka ganito? Blah, blah, blah. So, <laughs> after that, so, pinatawag ako sa dean's office. Kinausap ako ng madre. Ayun, tigok. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, that's it. And, okay. So, ay guys, meron din akong palang special guest. Uh, abangan nyo yan. So, mm. that's it. That's it for tonight. Well, thank you to Shandala for being ah, yeah, uh, yeah. an excellent co-host, you know? Thank you, Shan. Thank you so much. As always, Shandala. And, Tonzi, I can say, you're the man. <laughs> thank you, G. Yeah, and I can see this show, you know, uh-huh. becoming a hit, you know? Sana. You uh, did very well. Ah, uh, Coach, shoutout lang tayo kay Drew. Kasama ko siya yeah. last night, si Drew. Oh, si Drew? Oh. Yeah, yes, yeah, so Drew. Medyo, uh, hi, Drew. Hi, Drew. Kamusta, kamusta? Hello. Mm. So, yeah. Top 10 celebrity, uh, local celebrity scandal. Hope you guys yeah. enjoy it. And we're gonna end up this show with, with G and Shandala. No, you... Um, ah, I'm Tanzi. the one who's gonna... Uh, I'm the one. No, uh, let, let me just uh, say, in, um, this program is brought to you by PanoyPodcast.com. And it's also brought to you by podcastfilipinas.com. Your host is Tonzi. Mm-hmm. And here's Tonzi with his ending statement. All right, guys, since uh, actually, no uh, prepared to outro, but anyway. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, thank you. Thank you for 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 listening for for listening tonight and alam niyo naman yung topic natin uh, scandals controversies the 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 thing lang here is kung kung ma experience niyo man to uh, kung ma experience niyo man yung yung mga uh, downs and and uh, challenge niyo in your life just basically lahat ng nasa this natin they just move on whatever happened to them they just all move on kasi that's life eh. life goes on so Whatever happens, just just go ahead. Okay, so what kind of shadow affected? All right, so so I, I'm sure Mahal Mahal moves on as well. Uh, masaya si Mahal. All right, so so guys, thank you, thank you, thank you for listening tonight. Uh, next week, ulit, kita kita tayo. Okay. Salamat.
This one.